from KTVO. Expect more. Well, we did see some warmer temperatures for today. In fact, we're going to see continue on a gradual warm-up. But we do have some more snow moving in late tomorrow night into early Friday and a wintry mix for the weekend. We did see a lot of cloudy skies across the area for today. A little bit more sunshine in, in uh, northeast Missouri than southeast Iowa. But southeast Iowa actually got more snow than what northeast Missouri did. Uh, so again, that continued to push out on 1 o'clock. Still some light snow, some flurry activity in southeast Iowa and continues to move out of our area. What is left is some cloudy skies and some dry conditions for tonight. Over the next 24 to 48 hours, we are going to see uh, increasing clouds for tomorrow night because after midnight, that's when we're going to see another chance for some light snow moving in. This is around 6 in the morning on Friday. It'll be out of here by noontime, leaving about an inch or so of snow accumulation expected at this time. So we'll keep an eye on that just in case anything changes, but about an inch of snow is expected at this time. What is going to be warming up are the temperatures. We are going to see around into the mid to upper teens around 6, 7 in the morning, and then in the lower 30s around lunchtime, and then warming up even more into the afternoon with highs into the upper 30s. So very nice warming temperatures. Uh, right now, 29 degrees in cloudy skies at the Kirksville Regional Airport. Winds are out of the north-northwest at 5 miles per hour, dew point 13, and relative humidity levels at 51%. Not as warm in Ottumwa, 22 degrees with cloudy skies. In fact, uh, the cloudy skies continue to stay with southeast Iowa. Therefore, we didn't actually warm up that much as northeast Missouri. Winds are out of the east-southeast at 6 miles per hour. Dew point 16 and relative humidity levels at 78%. Lower 20s in southeast Iowa, 23 in Centerville, 34 degrees in Macon. And Fairfield, you're coming in at 21 degrees at this hour. 15 degrees as your overnight low for tonight, so much warmer temperatures than what we woke up to this morning with cloudy skies will continue to remain with us. Southwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Well, another blood drive, blood drive is going on at the Red Cross. This one is in Kiasak with the United Methodist Church from noon to 6 o'clock tomorrow. Temperatures at noon around 34 degrees with mostly sunny skies and then topping out in the upper 30s around 38 degrees which actually is pretty seasonable for this time of the year. It will be breezy, though, out of the southwest 10 to 15 with gusts near 23 miles per hour. And then a chance of snow moving in after midnight tomorrow night and into the morning hours on Friday. A little bit colder because of this system, 25 degrees on Friday, 9 degrees Friday night, Saturday back up uh, to about 34 degrees, though we are going to see a 40% chance of a wintry mix. 37 on Sunday, Monday, 44 degrees, and I'm going to say a chance of rain instead of snow. Of course, anytime, check us out 24-7 at heartlandconnection.com. And also, I'm going to say next Wednesday, lower 50s. Just say it over and over again as 50s, far as I'm 50s. concerned. Sounds good. <laughs> Bring it on. Thanks, Teresa. You're